hini awo mwegu traditional area awo ne nana naba antoni ansona abisa otosimienu wa da nana adadan kwa ekufu adwa se papa papa bona basu ye wo hihye papa wo de egu akwanso ama na dehye a wonom ewo atifi manta mu de wo bia etumi anya aso emfaso wo de sansem we etu dwa abro no ankasa ne nimpanyufo ebo anamo eko jubri house eko cha nana adadan kwa ekufu adwo i the paramount chief of the mirgu traditional area naba antoni anonsona abesa atasige the third bring you warm greetings from the people of the Mirgu traditional area. And I trust you are increasing in wealth, in health, and in wisdom. Mr. President, the purpose of my visit is threefold. One, to introduce myself to you as the Paramount Chief of the Mirgu Traditional Council. Two, to acknowledge your government effort in my jurisdiction. And three, to make an appeal for continued support for the development of my traditional area. Your Excellency, let me add my voice to many well-meaning Ghanaians and commend you on all the efforts that you have made since assuming office in 2017. Your pro-poor policies have lessened the burden of many parents in Ghana including those in my traditional area. Your Excellency, the boldness to implement the free senior high school policy will never be forgotten by Ghanaians, and you will forever be remembered for exhibiting the policy bravery necessary for taking such a tough but necessary decision. First of all, let me welcome all of you very warmly to the seat of the Presidency of Ghana, to Jubilee House. And to say that I've been, it's been some time since this visit was originally uh, scheduled. And I'm happy that today finally you have made your way here. I want to begin by thanking you very much for the smock, the cola, and all the gifts that you brought to me. And also to thank you very much for the words of commendation that have come from the mouths of your spokesperson about the work of our government. I think such words of commendation serve as, uh, as encouragement to continue to work even harder for the progress of our country. And I'm glad that some of the things that we have sought to do has found favor with you and your subjects and that they're helping improve the living standards of the people of the Mirigu traditional area. I've taken note of the, the key demands that you've put on the table, some of which I think can be addressed quickly, others take a little bit more time. As far as the creation of the district is concerned, you know there are certain criteria that have to be met. We will look at all of that, but I would entreat you to be patient, a little bit more patient. You've been waiting since 1984. That's already somewhat nearly uh, nearly 40 years. I, I think that if we start dealing with it again early next year, we'll be able to get a satisfactory result for you. And that is what i like to leave you with. I'm grateful for the visit.